Hey guys, this is Versatile from Game Dexterous. I got a really awesome tutorial. I'm going to really love this tutorial because it's one of my most favorite games of all time. It's Twisted Metal 2. It took me over a decade before I realized I could actually play this game online. So here is this awesome tutorial. So how are we going to do this? So I'm using Windows 7 64-bit and what we're going to need is Windows XP. Either you have the real Windows XP or you do it inside a virtual machine. Now, I'm going to be taking a lot of shortcuts here. So if you don't understand what I'm saying, see the more info section. I'll have a more... Um, text there to help you understand this. Alright, so here I am inside my virtual machine and let's run the Kali program. And if you don't know what Kali is, please see my other Kali game tutorial, please. And I already have it set up to scan and uh, has Twisted Metal 2 already recognized. So if I go to game lobbies, like so, if I want to create my own game, this is how you do it. You go create new lobby, select Twisted Metal 2, and then have these type of options like so. Same thing for game information. Um, if you get a message about firewall test failed, don't worry about it. Click on no, and then click on OK. And now when people join your lobby here, when everyone's here, they click on this launch button, and life is good, and the game starts. So anyways, Hidraga2, he's currently hosting a lobby, so I double-click on the lobby like so. And here I am, and I'll say, let's do this. And then I'm going to click on the launch button like so. Now I'm using Camtasia to record this so the sound will be a little bit skippy. But when you're playing the actual game it will be fine. Now why are we using the Kali program? Well the Kali program is nice because it emulates the IPX protocol. I don't know if it really emulates it but it allows the IPX to show up in this game. If you try to use Windows 7 and Windows, X, uh, Windows Vista and try to play this game. You will not see the IPX option. The TCP IP is broken, so don't use it. So here, this is a good sign, IPX connection. Give yourself a driver name and alias. If you want to create a new game, you click on new game, and then you go ahead and set up your settings, which I'll get to a little bit later in this video. So let's click on join game. And this is a good sign. So here's his game server. This is a good sign. You see his name? That means everything's working. So I click on join game. And here I can say, uh, let's do this. And then I press on ready. And then he clicks on ready, and then I'll be able to select my car. The beauty of this game when you're using um, real XP or using like Kali is um, the lag. It's like barely any lag, and this is a really great game to play online. Uh, I was in the game with like up to six people. You can get a max of like, I think, eight people, and that's just freaking crazy. <laughs> All right, so we're just going to do a really, really, really quick gameplay here. Let me see if I can find him and uh, get my butt kicked. Oops. And like I said, uh, I am recording this in Camtasia. This is not Fraps, um, so it will lag me a little bit. When you're playing in real XP, um, you will be able to play this game in full screen mode. Oh man, yeah. But um, when you're playing inside a virtual machine, you have this little window to you gotta mess around with. Now there are workarounds you can do, I suppose, um, to make your window bigger, but... Um... Oh my god. I think the recording lagged me and I died. That's all right. So I'm going to go to exit. Um, I will go to exit soon, right after this win-loss-kills ratio screen here. And don't think it froze because it didn't. So let's go to exit, go to yes. All right, so how do I host the game? So let's go to new game and then select whatever name you want to say here. So let's do endurance mode. That's fine. Click on start. And then we just wait and wait and wait for someone to come. Sweet, so he's here. So um, let's do this again. And then um, play a game. Let's select, you know, whatever. Mr. Slam sounds good. I wait for him, select a car. And then we let the good times roll. And you go to the more info section, I got a link to a forum that has a bunch of Twisted Metal 2 fans, Twisted Metal fans in general, and uh, they play online every now and then, so uh, if you have the Kali program open, you might catch some other Twisted Metal 2 players, so it's definitely a good time. So let's go find Hidraga here and see if I can do a Grand Slam. But given that I am recording, I might get my butt kicked. Oh, come on. See, look at that. I missed it. All right, so you guys get the picture. So let me uh, exit the game, and uh, that'll be it. And if you want to exit the game, just keep on pressing Escape, 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 or whatever, and then you're good to go. So that is the tutorial in a nutshell. Basically, I have Windows XP inside a virtual machine, and then I run Kali, and then Kali's running um, 
twist the metal to, and then you play. And that's pretty much it. So if you like this type of video, please like, favorite, and subscribe so that hopefully one day we can get on the front page of YouTube. Otherwise, if you got any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.